All right, let's do a little bit more here from the abandoned apartment. We're level 65. I did spend all of my ergo on... This was possibly a terrible decision, but uh, I bought items and equipment to upgrade the acidic crystal spear to plus six, from plus three to plus six. So I bought the uh, components and then upgraded it. I looked through all these other weapons, the coal Majolnir and the City Long Spear and the Live Puppet's Axe Blade, and they're all... They all look like gimmick weapons. They don't seem like very useful weapons. So, now that I've gotten through that area, I'm a little worried we're getting close to a boss fight. And, you know... Oh, it's a wandering merchant. Hooray! I don't suppose you'd like to buy anything. Sorry. I've been on my own so long, my sales pitch is a little rusty. Hard to engage in trade when you're fleeing from monsters. <laughs> Even if the abnormal has become normal, the living must live. Buy something, and you'll help both of us. Well, honestly, most of my best weapons have come from purchases, so... Hmm. He has a military shovel blade, another... Another purchase that I could make if I had 3,500 ergo, but I currently do not. Oh, he's got... He's got converters for fire, electric, and acid, but I don't know which one I need. He's got a legion caliper. I keep calling them calipers, but they're calibers. Caliper sounds like it should be the right word. <laughs> Caliber doesn't sound like a noun to me, <laughs> so I don't know why they call them calibers. Uh, okay, so I'm going to buy this military shovel because historically the purchased weapons seem to be pretty good, so I'm going to get... Uh, I'm sure I have 3,500 worth of ergo I can come up with quite easily. Buy something, and it'll help both of us. Military shovel. What is it? What could it be? Another weapon that we have to upgrade. That's bigger than I thought it would be. Super slow. But maybe. Fairy tale of the three brothers of the workshop tower. Oh god. It's a it's a three boss fight, isn't it? Do I even want to know? What are all these recollections I've got? What am I am I supposed to do something with these? The fairy tale of the three brothers of the workshop tower. Thus there lived in Krat a technician who made the three friendly puppet brothers, an alchemist who breathed life into puppets, and a stalker who rectified puppets gone wrong. The three brothers built the craftsman's workshop tower and made phenomenal puppets. The puppets seemed as if they were alive. The good ones helped the people of Krat and worked hard, danced, and sang songs. The people were extremely glad and everyone was happy. They said it's all thanks to the three brothers. The three good brothers lived happily ever after. Ugh. A triple boss fight. I can't wait. I just can't wait. Are we going right into it? Ooh. I 
think something's afoot. The collapsing crot. Hmm. Looks like we're not going directly into the boss fight, so... Hooray! Whoa! This used to be the workshop's transportation base close to Krat's central station. Maybe that's why the puppets were so hell-bent on attacking the place during the frenzy. But I didn't see it myself. I, I didn't know the scale of it all. So let's add that earthquake to our list of strange and bizarre happenings in Krat and... I'll keep moving. Woohoo! Gemini, you've been so helpful this whole game. Providing context for the things that are not obvious in the game. Hmm, a little disruption crystal. Will they explode when I get close to them? Uh oh. Oh, I see. They cause disruption when I get close to them. I see. So... Ah, cool. I bet they're gonna explode with corruption. No, I just have to break them. Okay. I thought they were gonna explode and corrupt me. A lover's letter to my beloved Gideon. Oops, I thought I pressed the button in time, but I didn't. The world is dying. I hear news of the epidemic dozens of times a day. If, on top of this, I am not able to see you, I may suffocate and die. I'll wait for you at the sign tonight, as usual. Don't be late, my love. Is that you two? Oh, it's you two, huh? Bet you wished you hadn't done that now. Oh. Wow, that guy's moving quite slowly. Trying to think of where this is copied and pasted from in Souls games. It sort of reminds me of the final area in Dark Souls 1. The, uh, the, the place beyond the Lord Vessel, I forgot what it's called. Neat. So there's going to be some of those hidden in places that we're going to have to find. The uh, disruption crystals remind me of the, uh, the the barrels. I think they were barrels in Dark Souls 2. They're sort of cut and paste from there. In the, uh, the place near where those uh, invisible thief dudes were. tougher than I expected. A shortcut we can't unlock. Hmm. Oh, really? You want me to try to get to a butterfly in these circumstances? Really? What precarious place is this butterfly? It's up above, I bet, isn't it? shot put. Hmm, well it kind of looks like we need to go across. Then we got a crystal there, and we got one there. Oh, 
Okay. I got the wrong thing selected, as per usual. I, As per usual, I don't know how I've deselected my healing potions, but somehow I've managed it. There's the purple butterfly. It's flown far away. Oh, this is going to be a problem. Oh, God. Okay, 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 sure. Sure, sure. Okay, yeah, sure, sure. Burn him. Oh, he's fire resistant, isn't he? Okay, that's cool. Cool. This guy's not gonna go down easy because of those tentacles. to walk off an edge. Oh man, that was lucky. <laughs> he was about to demolish me. Just as my sword runs out of durability. The sword doesn't last very long. The boss weapons are very fragile. Will I be able to unlock that shortcut? Shortcut. Hmm. There's some graffiti over here. They say when crystals appear from the ground, it's a sign of end days. It's the end. We're all going to die. Everyone's going to die. Festive art on the walls. I don't see anything over that way. Somewhere around here there was a, a secret thing we were supposed to unlock. Like one of those cipher areas. Yeah, there's disruption from an unknown source. Just like Dark Souls 2. So there's a crystal somewhere, but we don't know where. Oh, there it is. jump down there yet. I don't think I want to jump down there yet. I'm gonna go back and go the other direction. Because this feels like the way forward.
there was something else over here, too. This way. Fire dagger for the little bug people. Oh, that's another bug person. I didn't see him there. Lots of disruption. Do I have something to stop disruption, I wonder? It has just occurred to me to look for that. Uh, fire, electric. Let's do the fire one, I guess. Oh, I'm already wearing the one that decreases disruption. <laughs> I'm already resistant to it. Great. Not very, though. figured out what what good the uh, different types of grinders are. They haven't really done much for me. a dead end. Kind of looks like a dead end. Wait, here's something. Seasons Bookstore is what I'm just passing. This feels like an area where I, one of those ciphers should be. I guess I should make a cursory attempt to look at one of those. <laughs> Before I cough to death. Where are those ciphers? Are they books? I don't even know where they are now. Note left at the counter. Were they documents? Cryptic vessels are way at the bottom. I should have looked at the bottom. Check the ground at the end of the cliff of Krat Central Station Street. Where there's a good view of the ocean. Okay, so I don't... I haven't seen anything that looks like a good view of an ocean, so... Screw this place. I'm getting out of here.
guess I'm going back to the shortcut. Now I'm going to that place that where I jump down and can't get back from. perfect block because I couldn't do anything else. Can't do anything when they're rushing at you like that. I'm completely and totally stuck here. I'm obviously going to die. Wow. Okay. That seems unfair, but sure. Why not? At least we have a shortcut back there, if I can remember how to get there. Okay, cool. You know I'm getting tired of this game when I just try to rush through and <laughs> just... I just can't be bothered fighting anybody or it's just... I just want to one-shot kill everybody. <laughs> like, can I just get to the place I want to get to without an ordeal every single time? We've established by now that this part of the game is not fun, so I would like it to be... I would like it to go faster. <laughs> I'm stuck again. He's just hitting me repeatedly. Wow. Okay, run past, I guess. No, we have to kill him to proceed, don't we? Um... I don't really think I have a weapon that's going to dispatch him quickly. Unless I can... No, this the screwdriver's not going to work because he just continually attacks. He just He's just a machine gun of melee attacks, so this thing's not going to work. Maybe I need that shovel. Can I run past... without... Stopping. Oh, wrong way. Nope. 
I am not going to be able to do anything. I am stuck again. I very luckily got that heal off. Oh. There's no way out of this room, yeah. We gotta kill him to open a door, okay. Night, neat, neato. Fun. Super fun, Liza P. You guys are really doing a very good job of trolling the player. Feels very fun. What if I... Can I use acid on him? I know that's not going to work, but... get back? Can I get away from his attacks? No, he just... He's just gonna... This is all about blocking. You're not gonna survive this until you learn these blocks. Okay, heal again. Heal, heal, heal. Quick, 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 quick. This, wow. I, I just want to quit the game now. This is stupid. <laughs> this fight is stupid. It's in a very enclosed space. I can't move around. I get stuck on the walls all the time. I get blocked into corners all the time. Okay, I... sure. Um, I'll just keep trying weapons <laughs> until one of them works, I guess. This is, this is fun. There's probably an optimal way to, to get this guy, but I don't know what it is. Now I got this guy following me because of random luck. Wow, he starts right away with that heal. I tried to dodge that. And he follows it up immediately with another one. Okay, cool. Now I'm strapped in the corner. He's flailing at me. I can't move. <laughs> Gotta be kidding me. Why didn't I remember that he follows it up immediately? This is all about the blocking. There's no other way to win this except perfect block all of these. That's the only way to stagger him. Oh, no, I'm wrong. <laughs> I can just get lucky and hit him with a massive hit. Oh. 
I'm out of heals, yeah. I gotta... I gotta try to hit him by accident. <laughs> That's the only way I can deal with this. Oh my god, arch extra heavyweight frame. And that's how we unlock the door. Oh god, that sucked. That was a very unenjoyable experience. Oh, I could have actually come up here, but there's nothing here. So the only way I got through that is by getting enough perfect blocks and then doing a wind, wound up strong attack that luckily hit him <laughs> before he killed me. <laughs> that was pretty much it. See a stargazer. Good place to stop. The collapsed workshop tower. Hooray. Are we finished with this game yet? Can it finally be over? Can the can we put ourselves out of our misery yet? The collapsed street is where we have arrived. In chapter 9. It does seem like a good place to take a break. Because I... All of my... My enthusiasm for playing this game is gone. <laughs> so... Taking a break. 